Hi, I'm Brian Westover with PC Mag, and we are here at the Steve Jobs Theater in Cupertino, California, at Apple headquarters, getting our first look at the Apple MacBook Air 15 inch. It's the larger sibling, 13 inch, launched last year uh, with the same M2 processor and many of the same features and overall look and feel of the MacBook Air that we've come to love in the last year. But it is obviously bigger. It's bigger in a lot of ways. First, there's a the screen, it's now a 15.3 inch display. It is brighter, up to 500 nits. You've got higher resolution, 2880 by 1564, which is unique to Apple, as with most Retina displays. It keeps the same DPI that you would get on the 13-inch model, but because it's a larger screen, you've got more inches to fill. The laptop comes with a larger trackpad. It's proportionally larger to match the 13-inch. It's taller, more, more vertical space than you would get on the, the smaller 13-inch system. You also get bigger sound. There's a six-speaker sound system inside, uh, including a new up-and-down firing woofer setup that they call force canceling. It's sort of like noise canceling, but instead this is about canceling out the force of the, the volumetric changes that the woofer provides basically a way to get more more sound and bigger sound out of the same space and power. What's not a lot bigger is the price. It starts at $12.99 and the actual size. Uh, it's it's 11 and a half millimeters thick, just like the 13 inch model, and only weighs 3.3 pounds. That's incredibly thin and it's going to give other ultra portable systems a run for their money. We're looking forward to getting this in for review so you can see how it actually stacks up in terms of performance. So keep it right here with us at PC Mag, and we'll show you the whole thing.